Hi, my name is Justin Odisho, and in this video, I'm going to talk about a simple way to think about how to get more subscribers on YouTube. So what I have open on the screen here is the lifetime analytics of my channel, and I've got two metrics open. We'll take a look at a couple, but I've got subscribers and videos published on a line against each other. So the purple is the amount of subscribers I'm getting and the green is the videos published. And this is on a monthly basis. So you can see I started my channel around 2011 a long time ago, kind of as a hobby. You can see some months um, I wasn't, uh, the data is kind of lost on those years. YouTube didn't really count it, but I wasn't uploading that much pre a certain timeline. And then as we get to this year, right around 2016, 2017, I started to decide to take YouTube very seriously. I started uploading every day consistently. And you could see I started publishing 30 videos in September 2016, 33 videos in October 2016, 31 videos in November, 31 videos in December. So that's a lot of videos, 20, like at least almost every day. And as you could see, there is a clear correlation here between videos published and subscribers gained. And it's not exact, as you can see, sometimes I was still gaining subscribers without posting videos. There's also a little bit of a delay. You can see there was this month where I started going daily for one, two, three, four months, and yet I still didn't really see a huge incline in subscribers until I happened to catch a good video topic. I started branching out into, I was only doing Photoshop and photo editing videos. And then I started branching out into video editing software tutorials. And, and I tried like three or four or five different things. Some things started to go viral just by, I think obviously cause correlation does not mean causation, but just naturally through making a hundred plus videos that few months. I, some things just happened to start working and I started to see that and iterate on top of that and keep doing what was working and improving and just, you know, actively working more, you get, you will get more lucky the more, uh, your, you show up, like luck will be more in your favor if you show up more or whatever the saying is. So you can see consistently, the more videos I published, the more subscribers I got and the less videos I started publishing the less subscribers I got as I took breaks or whatever. And here I am back again in 2020, uploading daily for the past couple months. You could see it still hasn't caused a sharp increase in subscribers and it still might not for whoever knows until something catches or something goes viral. Um, but I do think having these seeds planted, I mean, you could see it kind of is gonna hopefully mimic previously. And there's more factors that go into play but if I change here from subscribers to views, we can also see the more videos I publish generally and not exactly, but generally the more views I would start to get every month, the more videos I published. And even here when I wasn't, I took a couple months break, I was still getting views off of old videos just due to evergreen content in my catalog. But you could see there's clearly a bit of a correlation over the past couple of years. And if we even do views to subscribers, this is where you can see the clearest correlation. And what I want to end this video with this clear point is basically the more content and videos you post, the more views you'll get. And the more views you get, the more subscribers you'll get. So view videos equals more, more videos equals more views equals more subscribers. And you can see that's a pretty clear correlation. There's just a funnel. It's a percentage. This is going to depend on your watch time and your type of videos. But for me, I found in, in general, about every million views I'm able to get will convert into about 10,000 subscribers. And it obviously it will all snowball. What's pretty amazing is for every hundred videos I publish, it seems like I'll get around 100,000 subscribers just by the nature of how many views. So, you know, just start looking at it in this way. I don't have to go too deep into it, but this is just hopefully a, a, mindset, a mindset shift to view it more like 
a, a game or a business or a catalog rather than worrying about each individual video going viral. There's a lot more topics to cover, so subscribe. I will be going over more analytics stuff and information in this playlist on my channel. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you over in the next videos where we take a look at more.